Hi, it's Shakia. Um, I'm just doing my seven day post app tummy tuck video. As you can see, I'm doing well. Um, Oops. I'm doing well. I'm recovering really good. I'm doing more than I thought I would be doing a week after. Um, before I went in, I mean, they told me they made me aware of you know everything so I kind of knew what I was in for but I had no idea that um, I would feel this good a week later um, but everybody is different I said um stated in one of my earlier videos pain is what the patient says it is um, I just think that the P you know my surgeon and his team manage my pain very very well um, and I'm, I'm here the swelling's going down day by day um, I'm able to do more things now. I'm not as slow. I'm walking around. I'm outside. So that makes me happy because I was going crazy up in this house. Like for real. Seriously. So I'm going to show you, um, again, what I've been wearing opposed to, um, my white binder. I'll show you my white binder. This is the white binder that I got from the surgeon. Um, it was like a million times too big and it had to be wrapped and wrapped and wrapped around me. So um, he suggested Tuesday when I saw him that I cut it. So I cut that. Um, I've been wearing that. But also I've been wearing my um, my squeam, my waist central. Um, I like this because it shapes you. Sorry. I like this because this thing actually works to shape you. So when I was... My biggest, I, I'm, I was 412 pounds, if you believe that. Um, I would buy these things and it would actually like suck me in really good when I wore my dresses. So I've been wearing this just to kind of shape me and everything. But as you can see, I'm just a week out. Still have some of the swelling, but I'm flat. Like, I'm flat. Um, I got some pads and tape on my incision to protect it from the clothing because I don't want to irritate it. It's nice and clean and dry. Um, so yeah, I don't want to irritate it. So I just make sure I keep something on there or whatever. And um, that's my, my week post-op post -op video. Um, I ain't going to let it drag because, you know, I can get long-winded, y'all, and I can talk your heads off. But we ain't going to do that today. Um, everything's looking good, going down, sucking in. I'm happy. Um, I'm walking around and everything, so I'm good. Um, the one suggestion I, I do have, though is before you even when you start considering having a tummy tuck make sure that you pick a good surgeon make sure that you um, check all his credentials uh i know where my surgeon went to school i know where he did his right his residency i know everything about this man okay so like make sure you really do your research make sure he's board certified please just don't go to any old body and just have these kind of procedures done because you want it to look good. You want your scars and everything to heal properly. Um, and, and that's basically it. Um, I'll update y'all next week. So let's look at it again so you can see what it looks like. Excuse my little, my fat arms. So this is what it looks like this week, seven days out. Um... We'll turn to the side so you can see. It's no good. My whole little apron is gone. So when I lost, I lost um, over 200 pounds. So when I lost the weight, I had a whole lot like my stomach. I, I would look good in my clothes, but not like I would want to. And it was kind of a slap. This is what made, I'm going to tell you what made me decide to do this tummy tuck. It's kind of a slap in the face to lose that kind of weight. And still have this gut and not be able to wear what I want to wear. But now, as you can see, I'm just a week out and my tum tum is flat. So, I'm happy about that. Um, and I'm just going to keep this thing on. I'm going to sleep in this tonight. Because this sucks me in a little bit better than that white one that they gave me. And um, I'm just going to keep working it. And I can't wait to get clear till I can start working out. 
and I'm um, doing my little app exercises and everything like that. But um, I'm enjoying it. I can't wait to play. I got this this pretty dress I ordered from um, ASOS. I don't know if y'all know about that website, but it's like in the UK. I ordered this dress from there, and it's like a body kind dress, and it's real cute. Got this cute little neckline or whatever, oh. and um, I want to wear it. I never wore it before because I had this I had this little um, you know this little gut, and I was not feeling comfortable in that dress so um there was many many reasons why i made the decision to have it but this is my my week one post-op i'm doing good i'm feeling good i'm looking all right <laughs> so y'all be easy Mom. um you can get this the name of the store is shh, you can get this waist center it's called a scream is $54. You can either get it online at fashion to, fashion to figure dot com or you can go to the, if you're in the Philadelphia area, you can go to Cherry Hill Mall, get it from Fashion to Figure store. Or if you're in Philadelphia, you can go down on um to South Philly, Pash Young Avenue to Harry's Innerwear. She also sells them in the store. Um and you can get them. And they have different kinds. They have the vest and then they have this this waist cincher. Um but I just wanted to let you know because I made a reference about the screen before. And I live by this thing. And when I tell you, if you wear it like the directions tell you to. And I, I always use, if you notice, I put it on over top of the tank top. I don't put this directly on my skin because it's rubber on the outside, cotton on the inside. I have fresh incisions. There's no way I'm putting anything on my skin. Because um, I do not want an infection. You don't want an infection. So... You don't want to put things directly on your skin. Make sure your incision is, is covered. But you have to let it breathe sometimes as well. So I can get some air. That's also good for it. But um, I'll update y'all next week. And uh, I'm signing out. So hopefully if you're thinking about doing it or you did it. I wish you a speedy recovery. Um, I'm recovering great. Um, thanks for all the well wishes. Um, thanks for watching my video. If you have any questions or anything, even if you just like this, this thing to wear for your dress or whatever, I can tell you where to get it. Leave me a comment or something. I'll hit y'all back. You know, I Hollywood. <laughs> I'm just a person making a video. So, um, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.